telling me that when he saw a moon through a telescope, he was a changed man. I did. It, it actually changed my life because it was the first time I actually saw the moon. It looks like you're there. And it's right, right there. And I'm on the moon. And I could see the craters. You and had moon in the face syndrome. <laughs> well, the, the cool thing with the moon, and also with Mars, but no, that, with that was moon. my hazing. <laughs> okay. Moon in the face, but that's when, when you look at the moon, you are actually seeing the moon. You're seeing the brand. You're right. seeing the craters. Right. When you look oh, because you don't Jupiter, see through the atmosphere. You're looking at yeah, Saturn. There's you're no not atmosphere on the moon. Looking at the planet itself, you're seeing the clouds, that's the outer right, layers. The right. Uh, with our moon, you actually see something that you can relate to. I it's never thought about that before. It's pretty That's cool. So it's, uh, it's very interesting. But you could probably see the shadow cast by the Rocky Mountains from the moon. You could probably shadow. see that. Shadow. And by the, in Nepal, you know, the, the Himalayan mountain right. range. Yeah. You could probably. Is the moon relatively but you, you would need the sun at the right angle less so that smooth than you, the Earth? Like the no, Earth? No, Earth is way more smooth than the moon than is. Than the moon? But okay. That's why I'm only focusing on the mountain range. Yeah. So. In fact, from, space, from orbit, you can see clouds cast by, shadows cast by clouds on the ocean. That's always yeah. interesting I mean, to see, see as well. you can see that from a plane, yeah. Yeah. That's yeah. cool. Yeah. So, Marcello, what is the best way that we can get more people interested in astronomy and join the AAA? Uh, first step will be to go to the website, AAA.org.org, not .com. .com is the other oh, oh. association. Right. Do you want your car fixed? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> so you go to AAA.org, check the calendar. We show the upcoming events. We have a big event coming up in October 1st in Central Park, Ship Meadow. We call it the Star Fest. You know, that's the biggest of the meadows in Central Park, right? It is. Yes. And, and fairly far south, right? Yes, and, and Very and close to the museum. Yeah, it, uh, it, you enter through 67th Street. 67th, okay. Mm -hmm. And uh, there will be many folks with their telescopes sharing the sky with you. And you can so you don't even have to have your own telescope. No. You can have professional you, amateur astronomers absolutely. show you their telescopes. If you don't have a telescope, I will say don't get one. Come and uh, look through our telescopes. Like because we don't have get many one. telescopes. They're all different sizes, different technologies for different purposes, and you may realize you only like to look at the moon. You find the other stuff not interesting, or you only like to see globular clusters or different things. So then you know what telescope to get. And we have many telescopes. We have so many volunteers that uh, very generously um, grant us time with their telescopes. So any member and anybody from the public, you don't even have to be a member, can go and take a look through a telescope and see what they like. And then we talk about getting a telescope, yeah. but don't get one.